My name is Franklin Obiora. My friends call me Frankie Mensa. And uh, I am a businessman. I'm a UX researcher, project manager. And I am on Waiting You the Yarn with Ize Sam. Oh, yeah, I like. Um, I like the camaraderie that comes with it. There's this, uh, there's this attitude change when you speak to people in the native tongue. There are some inflections, there are some meanings that you cannot really transmit in any other language. And yes, I really like that. The most delicious African dish I've ever had would have to be the sala soup. It's Igbo. It's um, it's um, it's a version of what most people would call white soup, but the sala is different. Only one African language for the rest of my life would have to be Igbo. I cannot imagine not speaking. I cannot imagine not being able to speak Igbo. It's it's really it's going to suck. Okay, uh, I once, well, I had to work closely with uh, somebody from Uganda. And after a while, I found myself starting to sound, speak a little bit like him in his accent. It was, it was embarrassing for me because I didn't know why I, I did that. It was unconscious. But yeah, I don't think I did a very good job of it either. Uh, I want the house accent. I think it is the, the most beautiful accent. And well, in Nigeria, it's for starters. I haven't heard any better in Africa either. Igbo, most definitely Igbo. Not because, not because there's any particular advantage. It's just, it's the one I am more, most familiar with. My house is not good enough to to write coding, so able. Does pigeon count? Well, I count it, Sha, because it's a totally different language. I can speak Igbo, I can speak Hausa, and uh, I can speak pigeon English. Oh my goodness, uh, 10% is really small. It's not, it's not possible, so. This is tough. I think I'll go with, I think I'll go with a little bit of most. I'll go with a little bit of most. It's, it will give me the more, most coverage, I guess. Yeah, I don't want to be a local champion. Any African language. Superhero name will probably be Ojemba. Ojemba. Ojemba Emilo. Ojemba for short. Uh, it's Igbo. It means a uh, traveler. Like Ojemba is a traveler. Ojemba Emilo is somebody who travels far and wide and doesn't have any enemies. Is accepted everywhere he goes. And that is what the ability to speak those languages will give you. Proclivity, I'll be tempted to say Almana, but Almana, well, Almana works because like Almana, proclivity tends to have a negative connotation sometimes. So I'll say Almana or why proclivity? Couldn't go for another word. Proclivity. Uh, Omume. My personality, which African tribe. I'd have to say, um, I grew up in Jos, in Plateau State. They do not have one particular tribe. It's like almost every local government has a different language and tribe, or well, a different language anyways. 
I would have to say my personality uh, originates from them because they are like really friendly, they are open, they are warm, they are not, um, they are not, um, what's the word? They, they are not really, they don't really have like, they are not, they don't take life that seriously, they are laid back, they are chill, they are cool, they are welcoming. From Dubai, yeah, oh, waiting in the yarn with Isesan, Dalokwan, call it.